Hello world, this is Ultima DJS with Only Interested Gaming. I am trying to build up my repertoire of films and videos and trying to mess around with some of the hardware and seeing what works best. Um, I took a break for the last couple weeks because I had a tonsillectomy and I couldn't move. It was pretty terrible. So, um... I am going to be just showcasing levels until I get, you know, a few subscribers, a few followers, enough to start doing some live streams. Um, you know, I don't expect to get anywhere near as large as some of the uh, more popular gaming uh, gaming gurus, I guess, on YouTube. But I am hoping to get a small following and, you know, hopefully start doing some live streams. Um, I have a lot of systems. They're really good. For, um, I have a really good setup for, for streaming every system that I have. Um, but in the meantime, I guess this will just have to do. Um, that being said, I'm going to be showcasing a super expert level. I guess it's just super expert because not a lot of people have completed it. It's called Mystery of the Mountain. Um, uh, when I say completed, I mean played. Uh, so, anyway, but uh, having said that, I'll start this level, Mystery of the Mountain. Um, see if it's any good. <laughs> Yeah, whenever you see a setup like this, it's almost always there's a hidden block. And since this is super expert, normally you're gonna see something at the beginning. I don't see anything, so I'm just gonna go. Hmm. Oh. Normally that's a soft block. <laughs> I was almost positive I was gonna get soft block there, but I guess not. <laughs> Makes the level kind of easy. Oh boy. Let's see. Kind of linear. I don't think I'm going to trust that. Yellow jump. Looks like you can go down there. But I want to see exactly. Okay, so you're not going to make that. <laughs> Alright. Then in that case, let's... I'm going to fire flowers over there. I'm not going to bother with that. Oh! That's interesting. I haven't seen a um, a pipe with power-ups that I like that. Uh, that's kind of interesting. Ah, come on. Okay. Oh, let's see what's down here. Here is... Death. I like this guy. Yeah. Knows what you're thinking. People wouldn't trust that, would keep going over and that. Uh, makes it a lot easier. Now I have a fire flower. Let's see what's up here. Checkpoint. Fire! Okay. Anyway, 
Looks like down there is kind of where you're supposed to go, so I really want to kind of avoid that. Maybe up here. Oh, well. Let's see. Hate jumping off of vines. That's why. He always gets his head caught. Ah. Oh, there goes my chance of money. You guys gotta be careful with your level design because if you have skewers at the top of the screen, that means that you can jump over them. It's just how it goes. You don't have to, you don't even have to mess with them. You just jump over them. Uh -oh. Huh. Oh, no. Alright, well I died. <laughs> well, at least try and keep a power up. Nope. Hate jumping off of vines. Absolutely hate it. Worst thing, jumping off of vines. <laughs> This is making a level where that is the necessary gimmick. Oh, no. <sighs> you have to find the perfect location to jump off of, otherwise, as you saw, you don't get high enough or you wind up just bonking your head like that. <sighs> I can do it, I know I can. I just take a few tries. That was dumb. I say like this, like I'm on top of the skewer right now. cheap. Get a notification on my phone and everything goes to crap. Oh my gosh. I wonder if that's possible. Like, jump. Well, it's not possible like that, but... Oh, come on. Ah, George. Oh, no. Small Mario, I seem to be able to make it. Oh great, more jumping off of vines. <laughs> oh, oh, start over. oh my goodness, that's the most annoying thing. I'm sure that anyone who plays Super Mario Maker will tell you the exact same. Most annoying thing is sitting there and accidentally starting over the whole level because you accidentally pushed start over instead of just letting yourself die. You need to have like a default start from checkpoint or last checkpoint because I'm telling you. I don't know. It's the most annoying thing. Absolute most annoying thing. Oh, 
some sort of gimmick or whatnot at the end, but whatever. Anyway, I already started because starring makes it a lot faster to um, to repeat, um, especially when you're using like the pro controller or whatnot. I'm not using mine right now, so I guess I just started out of habit. Anyway, but um, my Pro Controller, for some reason, the down button's not working, and it makes it very difficult to play Super Mario Maker when you can't duck. So, anyway. So, I'm pretty sure that that world record is pretty much up for grabs, because it seems like a pretty easy level. Um, yeah, I, I wouldn't really put it past anything to beat that like really kind of easy oh look it was one made by pink birdo she's one that uh i've seen a lot of her levels showcased from um from other streamers i just check out maybe one more okay i'm oh, oh. huh insta death at the beginning I'm sorry, but that's kind of just a really cheap way to get your level into Super Expert. Like, really cheap. Like, having a spike maze underwater? Not a problem. Having a... You know, a super difficult section that kills you a hundred thousand times? Not a problem. But... To sit there and kill you right at the very beginning is just cheap. At least in my book. So. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do this one. <laughs> Underwater courses are the worst. Especially ones with insta death at the beginning. I almost always skip insta death ones. So. Like, veritably, almost always. Just. Oh, this looks like a lot of fun. There's gotta be some sort of trick. Seems like there is a small opening. Right there. Upload levels like this. Oh, no. It's like maybe. Oh, no. hmm. oh, no. Seems like there might be. Oh, no. 
So I might be able to do that. One, two, three. Close. Ah, so close. That looks like kind of my opening. Okay. So when you play any game like this, you need to look for visual cues so that you can consistently get back to a certain point. So my visual cue is when the ghosts overlap a couple times, like three times, then that's one, two, three, same, it's possible. I 
think I can make it. <laughs> oh, oh. Say the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over again and expecting a different result. Well, fortunately, in Mario Maker, that's not entirely the case. you got to be careful of whenever you're making a level or whatnot is that if you make it hard but fun people are gonna start it if you make it hard but tedious nobody's gonna want to start it Mm -hmm. 
Mario has a really big jump. A lot of people don't seem to realize exactly how big that jump is. It's pretty big. So I'm gonna jump that. Just gonna... Ah. And the munch in there is dirty. People are gonna start. If you make it tedious, people they don't even want to play it. Like the last four one screen things, like it's just tedious. Like this one I would consider fun but challenging, but gauge where you are. checkpoints, then just remake it, re-upload it with a checkpoint. Because otherwise, if people get stuck doing the same thing over and over again, it's not fun. 
I know that like the Kaizo Mario community and like I I do some Kaizo Mario's, but the biggest problem is is like when you have something like this, it's just I don't know. It's different than actually like learning a difficult trick. It's just trying to get through tedious sections. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really playing any of these to really play them, I'm just... This is the problem with playing all of the super expert levels because um, most of the super experts are only super experts because they're either tedious or they're um, they have insta death or you know it's just. Just more or less people didn't want to have to deal with them. So they either played them a few times to try and get the gimmick, or they just left. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know you can win this one, but I'm not exactly sure. Anyway, I'm just more or less looking through these levels. Like, not really playing any to beat any, I'm just playing them to see exactly what I have to look forward to when I do super expert runs. I definitely won't do any skipless. There's no way I'm putting myself through this kind of hard garbage. Anyway. Well, I appreciate you watching, and if you like the video, like and subscribe. I mean, I know that we only actually completed one level today, but I mean, that's all I wanted to do. The other ones were just kind of messing around. Um, I will be probably uploading the gameplay for, um, for Calamity Ganon from the Breath of the Wild on my Nintendo Switch. Um, I haven't played it yet. I will, and I'll record it and upload it for those who care. Anyway, but once again, thank you, and if you like it, like, and subscribe, and you have an excellent rest of your day, I guess. I guess. Depending if it is the rest of the day. Maybe the rest of the night. <laughs>